You know, it kind of prevents them from doing their ability. But honestly, most of the time you're going to be in a, you know, a multiplayer battlefield like this here. Hey there, it's Big Tony over here at Nat G coming at you with a little War Robots action. We're doing Beacon Rush. We're on the factory map and we're going to run the Nether. This thing has been nerfed into the ground, guys, but I've thrown four MK2 level 6 tamers on here. Maybe we can have a little fun with this. I put the armadillo drone on here. I've got the wolf pilot at level 50. Nothing super, super uh, advanced right there. And of course, running my standard, uh, com you know, my my standard setup as far as uh, you know, my passive modules go: nuclear, immune, and repair amplifiers level six. And I've got a level, tw I've got a maxed out level 12 uh, armadillo drone here. Okay, I saw a video here the other day where someone's saying this is the Ocho counter. This is the Ocho killer. I'm going to say under certain conditions, yes. Because you do have, when you do your little dash, you can actually uh, do a suppression for a little bit. Kind of, uh, it's, you know, kind of prevents them from doing their ability. But honestly, most of the time you're going to be in a, you know, a multiplayer battlefield like this here. And yeah, you may get that Ocho locked down, but someone's going to clock you and destroy you. You're not going to get a chance. It's a, I think it's a great you know, it's a great way to uh, escape and elude a Ochokochi, but this is definitely not a brawler build. And you can see up there, I've only got 165,000 hit points. This is not going to go nose to nose with an Ocho for very long. In fact, I'm really kind of reliant on other bots being my meat shield, like that poor Blitz right there. Uh, get back behind hover, get a little healing going. Let's see if we can't get a shot on the angler right here. As soon as it comes out, I can do a dash. There we go. I hit him with the special ability. This guy, we five more seconds for, and I get a reload. Uh, come on, come on! Yeah, using the phase shift, just like I do on the angler, uh, using that phase shift to give me a chance to get a reload going. And I do have the mothership, the uh, mute with the new uh, turret on there, the lockdown turret. So that is also giving me a pretty good hand as well here, though it's not maxed out. It's like level thirty-eight or thirty-nine. All right, let's go ahead. And, here says a leech right there. He's just going to take me out. Uh, or excuse me, I think a Cremola just got me out there from the air. I think that uh, something, something just hammered the daylights out of me. Oh, that's what it was. We got ourselves a Siren. He's got himself kind of a mixed bag there, but he's running Smoothas and a Cremola on there. So let's go ahead and uh, let's get to, oh, we got the assist on that. Now, this is a Splinter, and I've got the, uh, I'm, trying to, I'm trying to think of the Blast... The Blast Charge Grenade Launcher Light Build Weapon. My, my gosh, my brain is absolutely gone today. Let's go ahead and give this guy a little love right here. There's a nice kill. Yeah, the Nether, I mean, in most cases, you're, you know, you might get a few matches where you might actually get a decent run. But I'm going to tell you right now, it's, it's so nerfed. It's force field is so hammered into the ground that... It just kind of, all you have to do is just, someone just has to breathe on it and goes into pink mode, and you're taking full damage. Uh, it's just, it's just not going to hold up. So, I mean, I mean, if you're really good at your tactics, I mean, really, really good at using your dash capabilities, then another might work for you as a guerrilla tactics type build. But just know it's not going to last very long. It's just, it's just not. Not in its uh, highly nerfed state as it is now. Okay, let's go ahead and it's time to bring out a little firepower. Let's let's go ahead and I think I got yeah, I can get the mothership going here. Let's go ahead and boom, there we go. There's a little suppression, a little lockdown. Gotta like that. Now at level uh at level 38, uh the whole special effect that the mothership gives, the mute, is only about 4.8 seconds. So it's not long. It's a good I use it for dueling. If I'm going up against someone and I'm squaring off of them, I can kind of suppress them and lock them down there for about four seconds while a reload of mine is going off. And I use it in conjunction with like my phase shift and my special ability on whatever I'm running, whether it's uh, Angler or it's the Nether or even the Ocho, uh, even though I don't put phase shift on here. And as you can see, the new weapons do charge up that mothership insanely fast. Let's go ahead and give this guy a little love right here. There we go. He's locked down, and he can't do much. He can't get a lock on me. Oh, I'm getting hammered from all angles here. Okay. Oh, he did. He actually did manage to get me with the Stellar Aurora. Let's go ahead and uh, fine. 
we're just gonna bring out something beastie. Let's lift him in the air, give him a little love. Goodbye. That's called revenge. <laughs> Sometimes you just gotta do it. Okay, let's go ahead and work on this right here. <coughs> Excuse me. And let's go ahead and work on this guy right here. We got a Capri down below here. And up on top, let's throw him up, give him a love, and bye bye. You're out of here. Yeah, sometimes you got to save the match with the Newton. <laughs> I mean, we were down on beacons. Uh, we needed to hammer these guys down a bit and kind of thin the herds a little bit. There's the conductor over there. That's three, two, and one. Uh, yeah, I think I want the conductor up in the air. Let's go him up. Let's go ahead and give him a little long shot love. Knock that shield down a little bit. Yeah, I might get the assist on him. Unless I, it waits for reload. Yeah, here we go. God Rampage. Nice. All right, let's keep it moving here. We got him a little down to three. Let's go ahead and use the mothership. Let's go ahead and... Uh, Lock this guy down, suppress him, and make him blind. <laughs> I mean, my gosh, that new mothership is insane. Once I actually do manage to get that leveled up to its max capabilities, up to level, uh, I believe it's up to level 60, then it, um, seriously, that's going to be like six or eight seconds worth of blindness, which is going to be absolutely insane. It will definitely be a huge advantage on the battlefield. Okay, let's get that level up. Okay, we got it. We figured it out. We got it. Nether! I will run it from time to time, but really it's not going back in my hangar as a full-time bot. Ten kills, three beacon caps, two assists. A couple of those kills were with the nether, but honestly, it's I'm just not that impressed with it. Shout out to Detroit Ronnie on the other side, who he was down, I mean, seriously, he was down a player and put up a really good fight. And shout out to uh, Kuk Kuklacon on top there, had a 9 by 4 Alrighty guys, time to bell out here. If you guys liked it, if you did, give it a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel, hit that bell for notifications. That way you know when I'm dropping it. Alrighty guys, stay safe and healthy. Watch out for each other. I'll catch you on the battlefield.